Starter bids them farewell in the lucky last. Stanley Park slow, three to four lengths when the starter said go. Winter Baron and Slim Yanni looking for cover the early stages. So to Sabatini. Right hand side, Lebanese Pound with the yellow headgear came out, blazing a trail a length and a half. Earphones Boy down the centre and Hooves of Troy three off the inside. Right there, Sweet Symphony Renaissance Man. Slim Yanni, Chara Sands towards the outside. Prince Crest tries to get into it. Winter Baron is about seven or eight towards the inside. Hooves of Troy hot up against the inside. Renaissance Man trying to close in. Irfan's boy. Chara Sands the outside. Inside the 200 and Renaissance Man has picked up the gallop. Hooves of Troy flat to the boards on the inside. Hooves of Troy and Renaissance Man. They're going to go to the line. Hooves of Troy, maybe from Renaissance Man, Don Carari and Sweet Symphony. Once again, very, very tight. Could it be Hooves of Troy's day today? Let's see. Well, it looks an absolute whisker. On the inside, Hooves of Troy. Renaissance Man, I thought Hooves of Troy, maybe just... And in fact, wins are half ahead. Hooves of Troy. Let's have a look at that. 1,332 days gets lucky today a whisker. Don Carari behind these. Sweet Symphony. So Hooves of Troy in the blue and black silks on the inside. He always hangs to the inside. So he was drawn five. Hung to the inside rail to keep him honest. Renaissance man was putting on the pressure. They go down to the line as one. Earphones boy down the center. Lebanese pound not really persevered with late on. Sekulu the late scratching. And as they hit the line, Wendy Whitehead. For the Schultzes, Dickinsons, Gibsons and the Sheriffs, they'll pull rank. Number five, Hooves of Troy finally gets that next victory. So the whole team can celebrate big time. Back to the studio.